Greetings in the mighty name of our Lord and Savior Jesus. Thank you for watching Charis TV. I'm with our visitor and she'll be introducing herself to us and sharing with us her one-on-one -on -one experience with the men of God for this week of grace. Mama, can you tell us your name and where you come from? My name is Tisela Nimabele. I'm from Tembisa. And can you tell us the reasons or the challenges that made you to partake on this week of grace? Uh, challenges is my career. Like, uh, there was stagnation. I felt like I'm in a cage. And also, uh, I came for my sister who is ill and also my daughter uh, for her education because uh, she's struggling. Yes. And then you were with the men of God on one-on-one. -on -one. Can you tell us about that, your experience? <laughs> uh, wow. Uh, when I met him, he pointed on the exact things that made me to decide to come here to partake on this grace and he advised me also on what to do and I thank God for that. So everything that he told you about were the things that brought you here today? Yes, uh, from my job where I'm working, he even mentioned it before I saw him uh, on one on one, he pointed to what the exact real problems that I came here for. And after your session with him, did he pray for you? I touch you. Hey. What are you doing now? When I'm guy. Huh? What, what is that? Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? She's even coming from Nigeria. Nothing will go well in her life. Who are you? Say it again. Malabul. She's coming from that one in Nigeria. You will prophesy her. You will speak. She's coming from Prophet Joshua. Yes, that one. Uh -huh. So? Manje. Even there by angel, she's not going anywhere. So you want her to travel everywhere? Now she's tired, just saying the God of Apostle, God of Apostle, God of Apostle. So you don't believe that God of Charis will help her? I would say Bishop of Charis can't She knows. Watch but I won't allow. That's but why I'm killing her. I'm going to kill her with the chest. That's why what? I'm killing her with the chest. the chest. Oh, you are killing her with the chest? Because you can't breathe, you can't breathe, you'll die. So you what? know, you know it will happen. Mm -hmm. That's why you want to kill her. Yeah. But she will never see it. When she went to, when she went to, when she went to the prophet, where were you? I was just sitting on the bed and she provoked me. Since then, I made her life a I was just sitting under her legs and she provoked me. Since then, I'm making her life a living hell. Why so did she go to Nigeria? Why did she go to Nigeria? I was just Nigeria? sitting. I was just sitting. I was not doing anything. I was not doing anything. So she went to Nigeria. She went to Nigeria. She provoked me. I will show her. I will show her. So now you know that because you went to the prophet, there's something that has happened to you. You know now. But she won't live to see it. She won't live to see it. I can kiss. You see, what is it possible? Do you know this child? Savior of the family, it is true that if you can deliver this one, but I can kiss myself on the elbow. Do you want to die? Yes, if I don't kill her, I'll die, but I'll kill her. It's obvious that if I don't kill her, I will die, but I will kill her. Let us see if you will kill her. Because there is power of God now. 
Amen. That is breaking you. All your powers break. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Break. 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 Amen. Break. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. She will never wear a ring in a finger. I say break. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. You are delivered. Amen. He's free. Amen. He prayed for me and he delivered me. And how do you feel after your deliverance? I am free. Uh, another thing that I forgot to mention, I had a problem with my chest, like I couldn't breathe. And as he was talking, he also mentioned that as well to me, that the devil wants to kill me because of the way, because uh, I'm the savior of my family and the way that things are. And indeed, after praying for me, my chest was, I'm cleared, like I can breathe well, I can feel my chest now. Yes. And how do you feel that God healed you instantly? I bless God. I give glory to Jesus. And for those who did not make it for this week of grace, what would you like to encourage or say to them? Uh, what I would like to encourage uh, people out there is that there is God in Charis. I know. Uh, you must come. If there's a week of grace, come and register. You can also come as a visitor because they accept visitors every week. So just try God. Try God of Charis. If you have been everywhere and nothing worked for you, just try the God of Charis. I know, I'm a witness, I know what God of Charis can do. Mm. We thank you for joining us here today. As you have believed, I believe that you'll be coming back to testify of testimonies of what God will be doing in your life and your family in Jesus' name. Amen.